about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking, we'll get away To a place where we don't know So my flight is in like four, three or four hours. So naturally, we're squeezing in a quick drone session <laughs> because I've never flown the drone all by myself before and I'm bringing my very own to Peru and I need to learn how to do it well from the master himself. Not a master, but I will teach you the best that he I is, can. He in is, he is a master. short amount of time that we have. <laughs> He's pulled towards, towards me, towards like this way, yep. this way, okay. And then Once for battery and then you hold it. And then and you I wanna place it, it on the ground? Yeah. Okay. So your power button, you press it once, and then you press and hold. Ready? Yep. Yourself exactly behind the truck. All right, fly forward for me. Cool. Let's fly closer to it. So we, okay. what we want to do is descend. And go forward. And fly forward. So let, let's come in for a landing. How about you land it in that circle right there? Okay. Obviously, a lot more practice. <laughs> <laughs> I just need to get like the basics figured out and then I can start making it look good eventually. Good job. Thank you, King. Officially on the way to the airport. Is it big enough for you? You know, I could go a little bigger actually. After walking in this for like 10 minutes or five minutes, definitely started hurting. So maybe I'll have some ripped abs after this trip because this is just a core workout just wearing this. Um, okay, so I just checked my gigantic bag and all I needed was to show my negative COVID test results. That wasn't that bad. Yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> and my passport. And now we're just chilling at a little cafe, procrastinating for when we have to say bye. Yeah, and then I get to go on the plane with my N95 mask and my face shield because that is required for Peru flights or flights to Peru. So I ordered everything beforehand. So make sure if you're booking a flight anytime soon that you check all of the fine print because there's a lot of forms that you may have to fill out. Test results for different countries vary and different face masks vary. So that's gonna be fun. Oh boy. <laughs> on the freeway, Bonnie and Clyde. A classic cliche, we're on the run. This is what we waited for. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow. We can't miss now. I'm done living life with the lights. I'm done with my own doubts. So I did travel here by myself, but I will not be here alone the whole time. Hi! Meet Drew and Alex, everyone. Hi, guys! You will be seeing a lot of them over the next few months. They've been in, how long have you guys been in South America, Central America? We've been traveling for, yeah, like seven months. I'm now officially uh, the best third wheel around. Oh, yes. By far the best. So, the best that we've ever had. Yeah. It's gonna be great. <laughs> and we also have a YouTube channel, so yeah, if, you if you're not our travels. If you're not following them already, you should be. So everyone go check them out. We're about to go ahead to the farmer's market right around the corner um, to get some fruit and avocados. So let's go. Lavender okay. oil. We love lavender <laughs> oil in this household. Yeah, 
Thank you. Gracias. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we were very successful today. Very. very. Oh yeah. This whole thing, so strawberries, blueberries, broccoli, sprouts, avocados, olive oil, oat milk, potatoes, cauliflower, and the banana bread. Yeah. Soap and the lavender oil was 140 solis, which is $34, which is so amazing. Can never get those kind of prices in the US. No, and this quality, <laughs> I'm so excited right now. <laughs> Here, okay, there we go. <laughs> so I'm officially in Peru. I am right outside of my Airbnb currently, and we have a few errands to run, and you're gonna come with me. Hola, Hola. gracias, amigo. Fue un casa de cambio, por favor. So currently we're going to a Casa de Cambio, which is where I'm going to exchange my dollars for Peruvian soles. Typically you use soles to pay for things like taxis, markets on the road and things like that. So that is the first stop of the day. Adios, gracias. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Oh, sí. No. It's como un gato. Dólares a soles, por favor. Es 200. Gracias. Okay, well that was super easy. I just went to a Casa de Cambio, which is, from my research, the best place to exchange money. So I exchanged 200 US dollars for 814 soles. Now, I'm gonna head right across the street and go to Claro to get my SIM card for my phone. I have been using a Verizon Travel Pass for the last day. Um, it basically is $10 and you get, I think, one gig a day um, for talk and text. So I've been using that, but now I'm gonna go get a SIM card so I get a lot more gigs and I have a lot more access when I'm not in Wi-Fi. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. ¿Cómo se dice? Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Ah, suscríbase en su canal de YouTube. Sí. Ajá. Suscríbase a mi canal de YouTube. Ajá. <laughs> Creo que es correcto. Sí, sí, sí. claro, perfecto. <laughs> no, pues, no. Adiós. No. Try it for us, Alex. We trust you. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I got ceviche, which is native to Peru, apparently. So, we're gonna see how this goes. Are you gonna try any? I don't know. I'm still, still deciding. Okay. Quite possibly. Drew, Drew is vegan, so she will not be trying to eat it. Drew's got some veggie pasta. Alex has obviously already finished his entire pizza. In like one second. In one second, <laughs> and I have my ceviche, so I, I'm gonna try it right now. Wait, explain what it is. Oh, if you don't know what ceviche is, it's basically raw fish marinated in like lime juice, different citrus juices, and the acid cooks the fish. It's really good, but I've never had it in Peru. Bon provecho. Bon provecho. <laughs> Try this, Alex. Is it good? No, don't make him try it. It's like, trolling. It's like really good. And I'm from Florida. I've had good sweet today. This is not just. This is miles better. Really better than it's, in Florida. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. I went with the onion too. Very citrusy. And out of ten, mango restaurant. <laughs> So I've been editing this video and I realized I never really provided any context as to what the heck I'm doing in Peru and why I had to say goodbye to Dylan and my family and everyone in Florida. Basically, it has been my dream for years to work remotely and to travel the world. Of course, when COVID hit, I kind of changed my plans a little bit and ended up traveling through the US, which ended up being the most incredible experience ever and I am so happy that it happened the way it did. But now that things are starting to open up a little bit, I do want to 
continue my dream of working remotely and traveling. Of course, it is hard to you know say goodbye to Dylan and my family for longish periods of time, but everyone's super supportive of you know the stream of mine to kind of go abroad. And Dylan couldn't come because he has some really exciting things happening with work. He recently started a new leadership position at a different company, and so. He's, you know, off being awesome back in Tampa. And so I'm here in Peru traveling around and trying to live out my dream. So we're kind of just supporting each other from a further away distance for the next few months, which is totally fine. But I will be traveling around Peru with Drew and Alex for the next few months. And we're going to ex be exploring Juarez, Cusco, Machu Picchu, Arequipa, and so many more places. So if you have any recommendations or any questions about my Peru travels, comment them down below because like I said, I'm gonna be here for the next two months. And so kind of all of my content going forward is going to be a lot of Peru adventures, working remotely in a different continent. And so it's going to be so much fun and I'm so excited to take you guys along. Comment below any recommendations or just anything that you're interested in me creating while I'm here because yeah, I'm just really excited to document this whole entire adventure and take you guys along. But that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel to keep up with all the adventures. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye.